Behold. There are the nadir of the vortex, sleep's origin. In the sea? Deep beneath the sea where none may tread, Zed spins his world-spanning web. So you're saying... the Queen of Kevis... she's there as well? Well, snuff me. I want to save the Queen as much as the next guy. But how are we supposed to even get there? You can't even get near without being ripped apart. Yeah, but if anyone were to know the trick, it's Queen Nia. Seeing as, you know, she's the mastermind behind the whole origin shebang, yeah? Right. Actually, I kinda don't. Oh, but... but you're the Queen! How do you not know that? This is shocking. Absolute nonsense. I simply cannot believe this. I... I don't know how to respond. Come on, you lot. Rein it in now. Huh? Hang on. Hmm? Mio, don't you... Get to use those Mobius powers. Uh, um, well... Then it should be a snap, right? Pew! We're there! Those clowns were doing it all the time! Actually... Go on. I can't use them right now. The Mobius powers. What? I noticed it right after we liberated the castle. I couldn't work out why myself it was so sudden. No! Is this why you blew us off saying to ask the Queen ourselves? Oh, sorry, Uni. Oh, love. I suspect it must be Zed. Huh? The power of Mobius. It's part of the flow and fabric of the world. What is permitted, and what is prohibited, is subject to Zed's whims. Even with origin. Not every Mobius knows of his existence. But I was able to use the Ouroboros powers. The power you currently wield is, let's say, external to the flow. Even Zed himself cannot grasp what's beyond his reach. Therein is my hope based. <sighs> we're still stuck, though. We know where to go, but we're kind of dead in the water here. How to tackle the Vortex, then? <gasps> Mr. Salmon. Mr. Salmon was, uh, that Nopon from the city. Yeah. Recall what he said about a ship that could brave the Great Sea. Ultimate vessel. That right. Even Vortex in Raging Great Sea not slow advance. It'd go down in history as Queen of Boats. Still work in progress. But sure to bring to fruition someday. It's someone's dream. Yeah, he did say that. Something about it being able to take on stormy weather. Wait, wasn't that a work in progress, though? I think he might have been drawing up blueprints. Whatever Mr. Salmon said, he was pretty ardent about it. Which must mean there might be a way to get there after all. All right, let's go. Yeah. Finally, our lucky break. Looks like this place was worth the trip. Better hurry. I hardly imagine Mobius will stand idly by. Agreed. Your Majesty! Huh? Thanks a lot. Things are looking up. Uh, sure. Right, okay. Uh, I think I understand. If you're looking for someone, he'll be in maintenance, same as usual. I'll send someone to get you. Just head on over. Many thanks. We'll be outside the Cloud Keep.
to the city for a bit then? Yeah. Travis arranged to have us picked up at the entrance. stairs are super long. Hey, that gives me an idea. You want to do some sprints after? I'm just glad the people in the city made it through unscathed. Me too. It's a huge weight off my mind. I see some relations By the way, have changed. I seem to have angered Michiba earlier. She's hard to read. Any ideas, Noah? Um, well... I don't really think I can help you there, mate. Ah, friends mean old Butte. She tucked away, all cosy in dock number three. What, really? Curious? We are. All righty. Then please follow Sam on to port.
So this is it. The ship that can conquer the Great Sea's Vortex. So it! And you got it all ready, too! It's like a different beast from what we've been using. I'd venture to call it a masterwork. There's a real sense of power behind this craft. Please not to get garments in twist. This is just hull. Just, just the, the hull. hull! Key elements of engine not quite ready yet. Ship without engine is like... a light like torpedo wrap without filling of tasty sausage. That crime against cuisine! Torpedo wrap without tasty sausage like ship without engine! Mr. Salmon, what is it the engine needs? To be precise, just need core component. Is this part here, and still needs six more to make. Unfortunately, only have this one here. I've seen that metal before. It's the same as Noah's sword, right? Yeah, looks like it. Also, it's same as metal that go inside fancy eye patches of lost numbers. Friends know eye patches block Mobius tracking, surely? Yeah, we heard that from Monica. That because eye patch emits special wavelengths. This here shows sources of such waves. Points of light on map indicate where metal can be located. But Samon could not visit. Every place is fearsome scary. Can't you just use the metal from the eye patches? Those important equipment for lost numbers, so no can do. And even if could, metal is stretched into thin foil, making total amount not sufficient. That's a shame. Mia, look over here. Yeah, the Cloud Keep. It's that thing that the Queen had. Mr. Salmon, so if we got you six more, you could complete the ship? Naturally. With that can make ship with power and defense that weather any storm or hole in sea. How long would it take to build? We'll give it three days, tops. Wow, that's real snappy. Good, as time is of the essence. All right, let's crack on. Yeah. Mr. Salmon, don't you worry. We'll get you your parts. Meh.
Why are you here again? What? Huh? Oh. Hey? Uh. Uh. Huh? Uh. <clears throat> the Gears of Origin. What fate that they would be the ones to guide you? Ouroboros and the Sword of the End have. They brought us this far, so I wouldn't be surprised. I understand. Well, in that case, I will gladly concede it. You knew we'd be coming back though, right? It was all a part of your grand design, yeah? The future must be sculpted with one's own hands. Something like that? Right, certainly. The future isn't something you can just be given. You do have to reach for it with your own hands, yes. Well, that's the first. Five left to go. A promising start. Yeah, could be worse. Keep going like this, and job done! Thank you, Majesty. I promise you, we won't waste this gift. Wait a moment. How will you access Origin, even with the ship? I mean... We're gonna plunge into the Great Sea's Vortex. And after that? Origin is protected on every side by thick armor plating. You think you'll find a berth? I guess... uh... Maybe? For starters, we don't even know Origin's general schematic. We're going in blind. <sighs> Take this. What's this? Is this... Origin? A certain Nopon engineer was involved. On the Agnian side of Origin's construction. That's an early blueprint left behind from those days. The Great Sea's Vortex is likely born from the force field emitted by this middle part, amplified by the structure built up around the circumference. That would be my best guess, anyway. As for the original purpose of the structure, it was a device to deploy a field to protect the facility while it generated an omnistatic space. Consequently, this middle section here, it lacks the armoured shell, making it Origin's only weak point. So then, basically this is our entrance. Enter the vortex, and then using its flow, break through to the inside. Once you are within, destroy the force field generator at the center. That's the trick. Yes, I see. However, the internal structure of Origin may well have been heavily modified by Zed. Even after you make it in, you must be on your guard. Understood. We'll be fully prepared. Huh. You gotta hand it to the Queen, though. How could anyone know all that? Shocking, I know. Absolutely. I simply cannot believe this. Come on, you lot. Make your minds up already, will you? By the way, after you met up with M, you were sleeping here all this time, right? Yes. So then, how did you know we'd become Ouroboros? You seemed to know what had happened at the castle as well. Even as I sleep, I learn. Information on everything in this world collects right here. Thank you so much for all this. I promise you, we will seize the future.
The origin metal signal was coming from around here, right? Something so valuable here. Huh. The origin metal signal was coming from around here.
with you around, Senna. See? This is our future. This is something decent, right? I hope we can make use of this. No problem now. We're getting an origin metal readout from around this area, I think. Let's leave no stone unturned.
Is this where the readout for the Origin Metal's coming from? We'll find it. I dare say we're becoming old hands at this. You're special. Precious few make it all the way to their homecoming. But this won't do at all. Your lives shine all the brighter if they are extinguished right here on the battlefield. Hmm? What's the meaning of this, Commander Chris? I bid you sheathe your blade, my Lord Consul. Come again? You want to take his shine for yourself? I am simply stating there's no need. Why kill him now? Mm -hmm. His time is at an end. How brightly he shone. He himself knows better than anyone. Your actions will not make him brighter. I'm sure. Mutiny! Why not just let it go, V? Why are you here? When their appointed hour arrives, should we not grant them an appropriate departure? Don't be a fool! Then their life will be lost from circulation, will it not? Oh. Zed also wishes it so. Z? 
Jake does? I refuse to believe it. But, very well. Do as you see fit then. If I may, let me send him on. That's a good tune. A Chris original? Yeah, I suppose it is. Maybe I'll pinch it as well. You've got your own tunes, Noah. Those are just as good. Wonderful, I'd say. Really? I only tweaked a few notes in a score from my previous colony. It's not the notes that matter. It's the feelings you imbue them with. Feelings? Raw emotion. It resonates. formless dead. Will you respond to the Queen's awakening? The Sword of the End. Of all the vestiges of origin strewn through the world, who knew this fragment yet remained? It is no longer one with the flow. We have no means of controlling it. Will you go, then? No. There's no need, is there? He will come to me. I know it. To share with me his feelings. Is it here? It's not inside the castle. Okay. So that puts it at... Garden, garden defense, defense base. base! Garden what now? It's a guard outpost at the castle rear. They bring new recruits there too, for basic training. Well, phew. You had me worried there for a second. Thought we'd be back in the Antal's jaws. Even so, it's an enemy base. We can't expect to just waltz in without a fight. First, let's just try to scope it out. There were also a few Turkin feathers where the origin metal was buried. 
So Turkin's buried it. Crafty little gits. Gotta keep nice and limber. What is that? So it's beyond this bridge? Yeah. No chance from the front. Not like this. <sighs> we can go across those islands. That way, we should be able to swing round the back. Then, it's in and out, fast as we can. Yeah. We go in, we get the shard, and we hightail it out there. Right. I can't see another way. Let's do it. Week away from your homecoming. Why? <sighs> Noah, you okay? <sighs> oh yeah. Sorry about that. Hmm. Strange. Now of all times. Operate it like so. Check, ching. Time to take the fast way. Ah. You think we'll be able to slip through undetected? Whoa. I don't know. Got a rare dude all right we here. Proceed with extreme caution. Huh. Watch your footing, guys.
think you operate it like so. Ching. Time to take the fast way. This is unsettling. Not a single person anywhere in sight. What's going on? Is this because we busted up the Annihilator? No, I very much doubt it. We didn't do any direct damage to the castle itself. Maybe it's because of the Machini Queenie? Even so, we didn't actually free the soldiers here, right? And yet no one's here. Huh? The shard's changing position! Hey, Noah! Look at this! Noah? It's a song. What song? You're right. It's a Cavessi one. The melody. Yeah. And it's not just any melody. I know who's playing. Chris. Wait, Chris? Wasn't that the guy who was Noah's off-seeing instructor? Yeah. Huh? But Chris is... Yeah. He died four years ago. Does that mean he's been reborn? Like Ethel? No. I don't think that's it. What then? Like Mobius? There are two types of Mobius. The kind like Z and X, who were Mobius from the beginning, and humans who became Mobius, like N, M and Yorin. <laughs> so... Is this like a trap? Probably. But the origin metal readout is real. It's definitely here. In we go? Yeah. In we go. What? Into the jewels? They're clearly aware that we're coming. But there's no one around. He's waiting. For me. Hey, can I get a hand here? On it. And... There! I hope we can make use of this. This is something decent, right? Sweet! Let's poke around! weird's going on, right? The silence is unnerving.
give it a good once over. Good to see you again, Noah. I knew it. Chris. Thank goodness. I'm so happy to see that you're still an Offseer. Chris! Come out! Reveal yourself! I'm waiting in the throne room. Take your time. I want you to come up here. Then I want you to play that special melody. Chris! I'll be waiting. I'm fine. We need to go up to the throne room. Chris is waiting. Topographical info updated. I first met Chris on the day of a homecoming. I remember. A short time later, I put in to become an Offseer. And then, we met again. The name's Noah, right? I'm Chris. Starting today, I'll be your personal tutor, all right? Let's begin. Hey Chris, tell me something. Back then, on that day, why did you look so sad? Which day? The day of homecoming. In Colony 14. Ah, I see. So that's how I looked to you then. The others looked so happy. And the soldier, he was so pleased about it. But not you. I think... He probably felt content. Content? He had lived through it all. Fought hard. And in serving his colony, he found purpose. I find it's quite a tragic thing. But why? I mean, it was time for him to return home. What do you think that entails? Huh? Reaching your life's expiry date. Surviving through so many battles. Well, I... Do you honestly believe he was happy to disappear for such trivial reasons? That his smile belied no doubt? To me, he looked ready to cry. Huh. Being unable to choose his end. Merely accepting what comes next. Chris. There's no joy in a contrived death, Noah. Contrived death, huh? At this point, I get him. Kind of, at least. On that day, he shook my belief. Was I really content? 
Content with the path I'd chosen to follow. <sighs> and then he chose for himself. His end would be by his design. I need to know. What was he thinking back then? And why now? Why has he appeared before me? Now, we wait. Better give it a good once over. Chris? Seriously, those Mobius snuffers can really do one. Now, we wait. Boros, you dare to appear before me once again. Do you not value your lives? Such idiocy. You should never have shown your faces here again. But you leave me no choice. For sullying this consecrated ground, I will see to it that justice is served. What a terrible din. <gasps> Only an imitation. Its empty words could never ring true. Let me hear it, Noah. I want a true melody. Let me hear your melody. You'll hear it.
Why, Chris? Why become Mobius? Tell me, what would possess you to side with them? So I could see you again, Noah. But why? Your sworn mission is to change this world, is it not? Yes. And is that because you're unhappy with the way it is? It's wrong, and we have to correct it. That is all. I see. So relentless desire is what drives you. Desire? You fight for betterment, for ever greater aspirations. And what's wrong with that? Nothing at all. It's human nature, after all. But you still don't understand. There's something you must learn. What's that? To be content with one's lot. What do you mean? Don't you see? Only the strong can ever hope to reach the fabled horizon that you seek. Your words must be backed up by strength in equal measure. Winner's logic. But birds, what can they possibly know of how a lowly worm feels? Then, what would you have become of the weak? Would you abandon them? You would refute their everything? End their story there? Mobius are the ones doing that! Noah, what you're trying to achieve here amounts to the same thing. You really think freeing Origin will revive the world and solve all of our problems? You must surely have heard from the Queen of Agnes, the truth of this world. So what then? You're saying the Queen's lying? No. Surely not. Then what? But there is no guarantee. If... If the Queen is wrong and the world is not created anew, what happens then? Huh? What if this is some flight of fancy? What if you've been taken in, staking your lives on a whim? Who's accountable? I ask you that. Um... Well, I... I think... Still the right thing to do. Oh? It was your smile, Chris. I get it now. I know why you were smiling back then. I'm good here. I get what you meant now. You asked me once if I would keep moving. And my answer... Tell me, Noah. I will, to the end, so that I can treasure those final moments. Final? When that hour is upon me, I want to look back and smile. Then I'll be good. And to come out smiling, we all have to choose where our lives take us. For our future selves. And yet, lack of choice is enough to break a person. They struggle, suffer, clawing their way through endless fog. A world without choice, that's wrong. If death is a lie in this world, it deserves to end. So you'd rather perish along with the world? I just... I just want to cut this world free from Mobius. Whatever the consequences. Yeah. Otherwise... The Queen would never have told us the things she did. We take everything as it comes. And we're afforded so little. Still, no matter how slim a chance we might have, it's a chance. So if that's an option we can take, then I'll take it. Noah, your melody, I hear it loud and clear. Now show it to me, your conviction and your smile. Sorry, I can't go easy. 
mercy on you! Yeah. <laughs>
lightsaber. Beautiful melody. It's a beautiful song, Noah. Noah, the one who made me Mobius, was said. And it wasn't just me. J2 and N and M. All of us were human once. And Zed changed our very being. Why? Why would he do that to you? For that, you'd be best off asking Zed himself. But listen, Noah. I think in the end, I was happy to have become Mobius. How could I not be, after hearing such a wonderful song? Chris, Mobius are an entity bound by the confines of this world. Strong, yet somehow fragile. And in their fragility, they crave only the now fearing to tread even a single step towards the future. I chose the path of the Offseer because I had a thought. The sender and the ones being sent. I wanted to learn exactly what it was that connected them. Though we may be forgotten, our feelings live on. It is through our melodies that we carry them on. I think I once told you something to that effect. Yeah. There's a place doing just that. The city. The city is. The many lives born of the city. Lives whose existence was never recorded in origin. They are our future. They themselves are proof of the coming winds of change. I think I see. They are... our hope. Just as you once were. They too are the product of Ouroboros' will. And that is something that can never die. Chris. You knew everything all along. One last thing.
Noah. Huh? So those things Chris said, what was that all about? Finding value. What now? Chris, when he played his Offseer song, he conveyed his wish to me. His wish that I would come to find value in all things. He entrusted it all to you, Noah. Ergo, the rest is history. Yeah, but it's so... Sad, isn't it? I'm going, for sure. His wishes won't be in vain as we march on Origin. Do you truly want it thus, O oh ye voices? Then let me enunciate, emphatically so, the rules to which this world adheres, for the benefit of us all. Looks like colony relations have changed. Looks like we got all the metal. We need to hand these straight over to Mr. Salmon. My hunger is stirred. Should we eat? Fortify the spirit.
go someplace else. Huh, good to add more names. Let's make the most of our break, guys. Mmm, delicious. I couldn't eat another bite. So that's a new recipe then. Ugh, let's be off. Good to add more names. ship that can traverse even the Great Sea's Vortex. Phew, technology sure is a marvel. G yeah, I don't know what we'd have done without Mr. Salmon. Finally, Origin. No! I don't want to die! Mobius are an entity bound by the confines of this world. Strong, yet somehow fragile. Mobius? What even are they? Harvesting our lives to cling to life. Even stopping time. Mio, allowing for limiting conditions, we are reborn after we have died. A Mobius as well. Mobius, uh, they can't be brought back once they die. Why is that? I'm not sure myself. Although each of them is fundamentally aware of this, that's why they're afraid of death. They're scared, huh? I guess you're a new too. And he still killed himself. And now he's really gone. Still, he left us a parting gift. Yeah. The smile on his face. I'll never forget it. Not until my dying breath. Hmm. What lies beyond death that Mobius fear it so? What the Queen said about the key that we hold. That smile might be it. Because he broke free of Zed's control. The power of hope, if we're being tried. Power to create future? Big props for Manana! Any way you slice it, it's not about looking backwards. More like the opposite. There's no need to rack brains about. Riku think it fine to just be true to self. Riku makes a good point. Wanting to do what we want, to be how we want to be. That's how we should carry on. In that case, I'll continue down the road of the future that was meant to be. If I were given the chance, if this road I've walked were to keep on going, I'd like to spend that time with my Moa. Forever isn't it.
it's good to keep a record. We here, middle of Great Sea. Noah, please to activate cloaking device. Roger. Cloaking activated. No issues yet. Are we sure this is really gonna work? They're not gonna, like, open fire when we get too close? Maybe I shouldn't be here, if it ends up working to our disadvantage. We cross bridge when we get to. Uh, anyhow, we small targets, so we'll take every bullet. Riku, you don't seem to be taking this seriously. If worst comes to worst, we'll try to draw the heat for you. <laughs> That'll take the wind out of their sails. Okay. Hey, uh, what's a sail again? We've made it this far. Just quit worrying. Go with the flow, yeah? Fuck's sake, talk about carefree. It's go time. Full power to engine. There'll be a little drop, so make sure to hold on tight. Wait, what drop? <laughs> Nitro warning! So you've come, Ouroboros. Huh? Check it! The sea's looking funky! And not only sea!
any resistors will be passive and perpetual cycle. Mothers. What are they thinking? They're even shooting at colonies that haven't been freed. Taking pot shots now? They're still their allies. If they lost the plot. You alive? Monica! Just barely. They dropped one of our ships. How are you? Holding it out here. Bastards. I can't believe they're firing at their own. I thought we were the only ones they wanted gone. Yeah. If this keeps up, they're as good as raise the entire world. They're all about life, aren't they? As long as they have origin, they can keep on making more of us. For them, this might just count as charging up. Reveling in the final glimmers of our lives. They want us to flicker out. When the last light fades, they plan on starting over. In a world without us. <sighs> That's all kinds of messed up. Please don't look there! Detachment? But that's suicide! Turn around! Such trouble. So much unavoidable tragedy. In order to preserve the endless now. Fear not, you need not grieve. Lives come back around. In due time, you will all be reborn once again. Ensuring our deaths, yes. Maybe they're not even conscious of the whole notion of killing. How so? It's like a natural instinct. To them, it's as basic as breathing. Nice theory, kid, but don't make excuses for it. Of course. <laughs> All right then. Gondor! <laughs> We'll play the decoy for you. You guys gun it, yeah? Go and clear us out a path. A path to give this world a future. Gondor. We got it. If we're gonna get to the Vortex, we'll need your help. Riku, pass me the controls. Aye, aye. How's the engine doing? 
spick and span. Admittedly, we lose some instruments to attack just now. But engine proper is raring to go. All right. Let's punch clear through. Hold on to something. It's going to be a rough ride. to Vortex Rim, 304, powering shields to max. Now what? When punched through, open throttle to fall. We climb up flow in one big swell. Roger that! Almost like a Pharonis, huh? The original Pharonis. This one's the first. Not just first. I think all Pharonises derive from this one right here. So this is what it's like on the inside. It's all just machines and more machines. I also see trace amounts of the black fog. Hey, this metal, it's like Noah's sword. You're right, it is the same. Mio, you know what's in here? Sorry, no. Whenever we teleported, it was always to a large, dim room. I think that was Zed's doing, to keep the location secret. Well... Guess we're searching the old-fashioned way, then. What about the other Mobius? Anything? About that... It's odd. It's like they're right here beside me, but also far away. I feel like I'm surrounded by them on all sides. Well, this is the enemy base and all. 
Gotta make sense. Or maybe... Huh? This whole place. Floor, walls and ceiling. Everything here could be Mobius. <gasps> Is it them? No. The transmission pattern's different. This feeling... It's like it's calling to us. You think it's... the Kavasi Queen? Maybe. Where then? Can you tell? Go, Noah? Yeah, let's go. It's all been leading to this. Never seen this place before. That looks like a good rest spot. We could do with some food. Definitely feel stronger. There we go, nice and clean. Let's bounce. It's good to keep a record. Ah, rare item. Is everyone all right? I'm full of beans thanks to somebody's piloting skills. What were those things? They fall apart the moment we take them down. The black fog is gone too. They're not mechanical, but neither are they biological. Something wrong, Mia. <sighs> As they fell, I could feel it, very slightly. A vague whiff of Mobius coming off them. Those things? What does that mean? I'm not sure. Mia, didn't you say before all this could be Mobius? Yeah. Are you trying to say those things might be Mobius as well? But they don't even look human. I think the shape might not matter so much. Huh? I think I'm starting to get the picture. I feel like I know what Mobius is. You, who wield the Sword of the End. The Endless now is under threat of being cut short. Could you do it, I wonder? Could you slay the ones who advance relentlessly toward despair? You do, after all, desire eternity above all others. 
Now, take it in your hand. For the endless now, for that which you so desire. What's inside? Whoa, got a rare dude all right here. We're detected. Come here, I got something for you. You're a lifesaver. Amazing! Let's go, 
This is our path to the future. Get ready to fight! Come here! I got something for ya! You're a lifesaver! It's working! I'll tear it all down! Found this. What kind of 
place is this? What a view. Who knew this hulking great thing would be under the central sea? do with some food. Let's keep things on a tight loop. It's good to keep a record. Make use of this. Whoa, got a rare doodah right here. Yes. 
See? This is our path to the future. Spotted. Come here! I got something for you! Thanks! I'm tearing all down! Crush ya! Oh my god! I'm you yet, Noah! What's inside? Huh. Good thing we found this. Not to worry, just stick to the plan. Let's use this. I'll whack him good! Come here! I got something for ya! Thanks! We've been found. Come here! I got something for ya! Desire combat?
think this is the norm? Side origin. Cavesi and Agnium ones together. Snuff me. I'll whack him good. Come here. I got something for you. You're a life saver. Sorry. I'll go easy on you.
future. What kind of place is this? Are Gondor and Monica going to be okay? They'll be just fine. We need to focus on what we have to do. We should be able to move ahead. We won't get much further this way. We should locate some device that'll reverse the direction it spins. Ugh. That! I hope we can make use of this. Is this, like, a rare thing?
could do with some food. Okay, good as new. It's good to keep a record. Let's bounce. Not to worry, just stick to the plan. inside. Woo! 
there were no holes in my strategy. Oh, good thing we found this. I won't falter. Not if we can change this world. I'll take the offensive then. Yeah. 
来。Wonder what's inside. We've been spotted. Oh, enemies! I'll hold them off. Come here! I've got something for you. Thanks. Yes, yes, yes. 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 I'll go easy on you. Over there! Man, that's our queen. Melia. That's vile! How could they do this to her? 
with all we've seen of Mobius. I'd put nothing past them. We have to release her. Yeah. Took you long enough. I know that voice. It's Ed. You look unwell, like me, when you had us locked up. <laughs> Got my just deserts. Well, don't you look smug with my woman on your arm, Noah. Does this face really look smug to you? What else would you call it, huh? N. Poor Clod. You don't understand anything. You cannot have the Queen. She is the fulcrum of origin itself. By my very existence, I will keep her from you. Well, that's not gonna happen. Our schedule's tight enough as is. And also, this is our Queen you're talking about. So get ready for a right royal thrashing. You're effectively a part of Noah himself. We'd really rather not hurt you. But we will if we have to. Because if you get in our way, then Mobius or not, we're throwing out all the stops and then some! <sighs> Don't fool yourselves. Willpower alone won't change the world. We'll prove you wrong. You'll see. Watch! You cannot hope to win. Not while I stand here, at the brink of the void. Void? Hmm? That's just... your grief. What? It's called sadness, and We came here. For you, to honor M's wishes, and to rescue you from your sorrow. To rescue me? What meaning does that tripe hold for me? Now that all is past, why should it matter? If you don't know, then let me teach you. I'll drag you with me, deep into the void, to the depths of despair. Oh, 
I'll ask again. Why did you do it? Tell me! How could you murder the city's people? Just think! They were the lives of your own kin! My own kin? You're wrong. They were nothing but mere chaff. What? They were superfluous for us Mobius living in the now. Furthermore, all those lives wouldn't have existed without me. As their original creator, I held dominion over their lives and deaths. Listen to yourself. Tell me, what about M then? What about the love Mio had for them? Mio! 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 You're the one who couldn't protect her! In the end, you were powerless! And now she's gone! How could you? Answer me! You really don't know? Don't you understand anything? I don't get it! Why, N? Why do you keep punishing yourself like this? <laughs> you took the wrong path. And then you had to walk it alone. You just messed up. You messed up royally. <sighs> Regret owns you. What do you know? If only I'd made the right choice. If what happened hadn't. Clinging to the past obsessively. You just had to keep walking that path. What you've become is regret itself. Really? And what does that make you then? I am. All of us. We're hope. Their hope, he says. <laughs> What lofty heights of arrogance. Like some self-proclaimed saviour. Not at all. They're the words of the one you held most dear. <sighs> That's her. Inside there. She felt regret. Just like you did. And yet, she had hopes for the future. That's why she left everything to Mio. This hope of yours. How can there be anything like it? In this world, there is nothing but the void. Peer now into it, and watch your precious hope crumble to nothing! I'm trying to tell you! That's just the sadness speaking through you! There is no room for hope in this Only despair! Not if we ourselves become hope!
I want to be with you forever. Those words back then were the truth. It's what she really wished for. Yes, that's right. I wasn't... I wasn't mistaken. When I tried to give her eternity, that was the correct choice. And you ruined it! Because you've changed! <gasps> you still don't understand. You were together so long. How can you not get it? 
She wanted you to go back. Back to the name Noah. She wanted you to call her by the name Mio. Why? Why are you the ones who get to stand there together in this world, edge to bleeding edge filled with sorrow? Perhaps we just got lucky. Got lucky? Trace it to chance encounters. I've met so many people. Lance, Uni, Tyon, Senna, Riku and Manana. My friends have been invaluable. And of course, I met Mio too. There's a very small difference between you and me. If I had been in your shoes, I'm sure I would have chosen the same. You would, would you? Yeah. But not anymore. Mio and my friends. And not just them, but the other Mio. And the other me. Every person I have met has shaped me and changed who I am. Thanks to them, I can choose the future. Even if you do succeed at returning the world to its original form, there's no guarantee you'll live long enough to enjoy it. What about that? Do you still intend to persist regardless? Yeah, we will. We'll fight our way out of these ten years. That's all. Anne, you were just like us once. An Uroboros, fighting for the future. But one day, you gave up on it and made the choice to protect the now. But you know, that's okay too. To protect and to endure. There's shapes a wish can take. And I, I knew exactly what that meant. Mia. Won't you come with us? You could try to move forwards again. After so long, it's what you both wanted, right? Well then, easy choice. What in the... He vanished. What exactly does this mean? Noah? Is he dead or what? No. He's fine. Fine in what sense? For now, let's do what we came for. dream. A very, very long dream. In my dream, youths were fighting. And as many times as they fell, they always got back up again. A dream of young people simply trying to survive. Majesty. Noah, correct? 
have been watching you all this time through the eyes of my simulacrum. Well done making it here. The Queen of Agnes is already free. Now you are too. And now, that leaves only him. You mean... Zed? Yes. About Zed. He is not a person, but a concept. Concept? Everyone can feel uncertain. Frightened. These feelings coagulated and then given a human form, or Zed. Unlike those people who are granted a Mobius body, he is a true Mobius. Sounds ominous. So he's not even an individual? He is, and he isn't. There is some Mobius within you too. But perhaps you've realized that. Your Ionios lies in frozen time, born from the Mobius wish that chose the Endless Now. So then, both us and the world, everything that exists, it's all false. Everything that exists is reality. Present lives. And future ones. Mobius aside, the wills of countless people persist inside of Origin. The sword of the end you carry and Ouroboros, they take their shape from these thoughts. Protect the now or carve a path to the future the wielder decides. The future is undeniable but you must realize your own. I've seen what you've done. You can do this too. Very well. There remains but one more thing I have to say to you. Noah. <sighs> Mio. <gasps> Lance. <gasps> Senna, Tyon, Uni. This world is yours. Further below this point lies the nucleus of origin. You will find Zed there. I shall return to the castle and free the soldiers from the flame clock's bondage. Otherwise, their lives will only feed Zed's power. Nice thinking, Your Majesty. Counting on you. Oh, uh, will you need an escort? I would think not. Might you have forgotten who I am? All right, this will be the last battle. We're all gonna make it through this. I promise. Yeah, this new world sounds like a blast. There's no way we can lose. We're strong now. Just look how far we've come together. The world is in our hands. Right, let's grab it and hold tight. Together. If 
you told me I'd live to see it, I'd have never believed it. <laughs> the time has come for the city to mobilize! Kevis, Agnes, support them all! Gilgamesh, deploy! ultimately defense. Only destroy weapons on the outer rim. Noah and the others are heading for the core. Leave the middle intact. Screw that up, and we can't restore the world, right? Roger, we'll cut! Good to add more names. It's good to keep a record. the day. Make sure we're well rested. Personal hygiene is every soldier's duty. I definitely feel stronger. It's good to keep a record. All right, let's get going. Time's a wasted. Better give it a good one, over.
shall we deal with this? Come here! I got something for you! Thanks!
It means there were no holes in my strategy. We've been spotted. Come here! I got something for you! You're a lifesaver! 
死ね I know, but it's the only way. Right, the call shouldn't be too far now. Come on, hang in there! <gasps> oh good. Looks like we managed not to hit you. Monica! We've been trying to aim for the highest energy signatures. Score one for us. Good call!
You're not going back! Hmm? Well, you know. I got curious and wanted to see the face of our real enemy with my own eyes. So, here I am. I thought I'd drop by, since the attacks wouldn't let up. And what do I see but you dags having a picnic? Gondor! The Queen? We got her out safely. It's just us and Zed. Our real enemy, finally. Right on. Then you won't mind a little company. What are you coming for? What for? Well, you know. The head honcho's bigging it up in there, ain't he? I got curious. Gotta see the big bad with my own eyes, right? <laughs> huh? You wanna clue me in on the joke? Sorry. <laughs> Deja vu. Or something like that. Huh? Thank you. Thanks to you. Now I can say definitively, there are things in this world We must protect. Everyone's lending us their strength. It's all riding on us. This is something decent. We'll just have to live up to expectations then. I'll whack him good. Better make sure we're well rested. It's good to keep a record. Oops, they found us. Spotted. Make this your way! I got something for you! Thank you! Oh, tear it all down! How are we? Uppercut! What is that? Easy fish! Yeah. 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 
Okay. Well, up to you. Do it. Make this quick. Can't let you kill me. Scurrying out of the woodwork. You've got some guts. Uraburos. X. You want Zed, right? Well, you can have him. You still think you're calling the shots here? I'll prove you wrong. Once and for all. Let's get started! Now it's the 
a proper assault. But they're never gonna beat us. This will be a challenge. Don't lose focus. This one looking at me funny. Hey, you! I'll tear it all down! I'd say we were moving in sync, right, Tyon? I hope we can make use of this. Better give it a good one, over. This should prove useful later. Thank you. 
Nail or anything, have you? Now we wait. Time to change the world. Come on now, you lot! It's time for Colony 4 to show off his fangs! So what are you loafing around for? Get your asses in gear! S -s oh, sorry, boss. It's just the, the engine's conked out and won't start. Well, then kick the mud until it does! You gotta be firm! Really give it some elbow grease here! Sir, that's insane! This is a delicate instrument! Delicate? My ass! Whack it! Smack it! Show me who's sparking, boss! I'm telling you, you can't just kick it and... Well, looky here! Guess I'm the boss! Is this a joke? All right! Now we can come out swinging! Who's with me? Yeah! We owe our lives to them. Now's the time to show them how we shine. Come on, full throttle. Can't let the other colonies steal our thunder now. Are we? Zed. We found him. At last. 
How many times is it now that I and you have confronted each other here like this? Yes, you're welcome to come on up. How many incarnations? How many ascents into the spotlight? Once again, I shall endeavor to ask this of you. Tell me, why not resign yourself to the flow? It's unfortunate. Sounds like my memory isn't all that. You have come to stop the flow, have you not? This march of time, stilled for eternity. You intend to stop it by removing me. So is it flowing, or is it stopped? You're not making any sense, mate. Basically, if we can take you down, the world kicks up again. At least, that's what I'm picking up from all that. Human designs can be much likened to a river flowing. All humanity yearns for it, the endless now. That is why I'm here, you'll find. My existence alone, it is proof and evidence. Cut the crap! Who in the world would possibly wish for this? I refuse to be controlled by you. Although, thanks to the stunts you pulled, we managed to twig onto a whole lot of stuff. We learned how best to use the time we have. And for that, you get a real good thanking. You said it. The 10 years is a mere glimpse. We now know the importance of true choice. We'll build it for ourselves. A world with the freedom to choose! Not a hollow world of fiction like this one! Everyone wants a reality that they can believe in! Freedom is nothing more than fiction. A deception. Those with power, those who can choose, think nothing of it. What then of those who cannot choose? What about the meek and frail? Not everyone is granted as many options as you all have. Will you share? Give them some of yours? Will you call that charity? Or compassion? Will you show it? Imagining them who are granted it to be thus satisfied? Imagining not a piece of wretchedness to remain? Making the best possible choices under duress. Living the best life. There are no losers in the world I offer. With a turn of the clock, anyone can be a winner, given the time. The only thing we ever do is take lives! There is no winning! You can't just invent some rule! Why do you recoil from taking lives? The world itself has set this rule. Why resist? It is through consumption of life that this world persists. Denying it is self-delusion. The only outcome, self-destruction. It is unequivocal fact. The imperative that is intrinsic to all living things. The source of our power and of all living things lies therein. Young, spirited people, Trading lives, aiming for new, ever loftier heights with each new day. That explosive motive power is something we lack. The essence of life. And we are here to express ourselves as an embodiment of life. So that's it! That's what you're getting at! And just for that, you gave those two an impossible choice! Is that why you made Yorin and Chris into Mobius?! Of course. As for the why, it's because it amuses me. The action.
action-packed drama of your lives. We are its foremost audience. Now then, play it out for me. What will the next act entail? Bereavement or revenge? A revolution, perchance. This world is never boring. Not while your lives continue to make it so effervescent. I'll end him. I just got it. Huh? Fighting in order to live. The words Miyabi left me with. Now. This is exactly when they were for. Yeah. Mio's got it right. At first it was all fun and games. When we got Ouroboros powers, we were just like, happy to get to live a little longer. That was it. But now, things are different. We learned that for many, there aren't any choices on the table at all. Because they were taken from them by a bunch of crusty old mutters. The strength you talk about is all just smoke and mirrors. Real strength is different. That's right. Knowing when to be close and when to let go. Walking together. Eventually choosing who you really are. That is strength. And that's the real battle here. To find that answer. to choose our actions moment to moment. And if you dare denounce that common right, we will defy you to live in a future over which you lay no claim. Sealing away your powers is trivial to me. Now then, the curtain rises. Define me. You won't get away. No. Let me. Let the stage of battle freeze your marrow! Ah! What? No Find me. Let the stage of battle scorch your flesh.
find it. Know just how gutless you creatures are. Watch out! <sighs> That's the day. I've decided to have myself killed too. I just. I didn't want to believe that we were the same. I'll live for him, for Yorin! Live and keep my friends alive! This I swear! I'm not gonna imitate others' ways of living anymore! I'm staying true to who I am, and that's the way it's going to be! You wanna see what we can really do? This plan's gonna be flawless! Yippee! First step in your so called revolution. Shall observe carefully what you would term your strength. about the 
I know what I have to do. I work to better myself, so I won't make the same mistake. It's gonna smash you in! I'm gonna win this! You right, you pick mine! You would grow strong enough to withstand adversity. Fleeting beings, what will you show me next? Come now. Entertain me. It's been fun. Noah. Yeah. Yeah. believe that your strength has grown thus you would usurp me grasp the future I cannot assent the curtain closes
crowd me now. Let me speak. You can find it. This is all a sham! That's true form or oh. origins. Why do this? Huh? If you restart origin, time in perpetuity will flow once more. The opposing worlds will overlap. What lies beyond is oblivion. You ought to be aware of this. Why? Huh. Let me turn it around for you. How can you be so sure? There should be a future where it doesn't happen. No such thing exists. The present is all. The present is all we need. That is our unyielding wish.
Hear me, my loyal subjects. Starting imminently, we shall commence a full attack on Origin. The battle is not a fabrication. It is a fight to seize control of our lives. I need you now. Entrust your lives to your rightful queen, Melia Antiqua. Inside Origin, there are people fighting against all odds to create a future for us all. Those brave ones, they want to teach us the true meaning of life. For the future they dare to forge, let us join the path that they showed us. Let us join the fight. Look at all those colonies, fighting as one. Now that is a sight. If we can just come out on top today. Commander, we'll do it. We'll build it for you. A new world for every one of us. It 
has been a while, Nia. Queen of Agnes. I am in your debt across the centuries. Nonsense. Don't mention it. I simply did what needed doing and entrusted the rest to the right people. I see that you're still affecting that elocution. Oh my, it befits me not. Do not hide your stripes. <laughs> All right. Then let's thrash those goons, Melia. Gladly. Together. The will of young people weaving a future. That is, the indispensable force that drives worlds forward. I know just how scary taking the first step can be. And yet, it was young folks like that that set whole worlds in motion. Overcoming their own fears. In the hope that the future will birth more such people. Now I get it. The true source of power from which Mobius stems. And why they so desperately seek the Endless now. Yes, I think I see it too. What the Queen said. There is some Mobius within us as well. Yeah, and it's our own selves. We're scared of ourselves and we lose track. We cut off our own way to the future. The possibilities. In that case, there's only one thing we can do. To believe in the path we've walked this far and in the future that lies ahead. Try and resist. Break Mobius' dead. And then dust and honor must eat your fill. I'm sorry. I can't go easy on you. More with that came from. Don't come. 
How's this? All right. Thank you. I'm with you. Oh, 
We'll just have to take him down. Come here! I got something for you! Thanks!
idea! All right!
Rebels will! You taking the mick? It's terrifying! Not knowing how tomorrow will turn out! How you will! But still, you can't just hold it in place! If you did that, you'd never change! You can't change the world like that! That's why I want to move on! We'll claim the future and shape it ourselves! And when you cannot choose, what well then? In that desperate moment, we'll all be there to soothe you! The self is all that exists. As such, the only cure for despair is total oblivion! That is the face of the world! I hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it, hate it! This rotten world! I love it! So he didn't disappear back then? Mm-mm. They were inside, with us. Think about it. They're still really the same people. We were conceived from regret. Sorry. Unlike you, who sprung forth from hope. Regret is our be-all and end-all. If only we'd made the right choice. If only things had been different. Blindly, we never try to change ourselves. Wishing only that the world would instead. We clung to the egotistical dream of being together forever. But that's only natural! Anyone would wish for that! Nothing to be ashamed of! Thank you. But now, our prolonged existence here, it only serves to strengthen those within this frozen moment in time who would keep it thus. So you see, we have but one choice here. Stop it! M! M! Don't do it! We'll think of a way to deal with Mobius! What you see over there is not Zed or Mobius, but a single, intense desire. Your thoughts, they can never affect a desire. But we, we who embody that very same desire... You can just stay here! Please, stay! Walk this world with us! We can walk it together! Noah's right! You've done enough! You don't have to do this! You could finally be here together! Such kindness. Your eyes, they brim with it. I ask myself, were our eyes the same on that day? No, Mia, but we came from different. 
different worlds, we were able to leave a life behind. It was our hope for the future. Our hearts and our dreams intertwined. And we were given the chance to weave new life. And therefore, it's all good. Believe in yourselves. All of you will certainly reach heights that we were unable to. You guys can surely make it. You can take our place in the future. Zed and the other Mobius. They wanted to protect the world too. That's why they created one they could control. I see where they were coming from. That's something that we feel almost every day. Having to change, to continue to change, that's sparking scary. But we can say this, even if we are reborn later, right then, what we think and feel that moment is real. To sacrifice that is never the right way. If you can't be true to yourself, then you're doing something wrong. Are you content with your decision? <sighs> Very soon, the stilled flow of time will restart. You can change your mind if you act now. Uh-uh-uh. You did not just tell us to become Mobius. Yeah, can you even imagine? Uh, Noah? Why are you wavering, Noah? Some want to go on, and some want to stay. In this world, there are so many mingled desires. But do we? Does anyone have the right to choose? Oh, don't you start minding us now. Just having the chance to be born in that world you make, that'll be plenty. So, you know, you just gotta do it your way. Gondor. Eh, uh, though if I can, I might want a better name, eh? Noah, all of us here want the same thing. It's how the future should be. Yeah, you're right. The future is right there. Believe in the actions you've taken, in your friends. And above all, you should believe in yourselves. Well then, the answer's simple.
Noah, come on. Ain't got all day. Yeah, I know. Right with you. I realized there's something I haven't said yet. Oh, yeah? I haven't thanked you. What's this now? Thank you for sticking with me. Without you by my side, I'd never have made it here. Oh, come on. You had to say that? I'm serious here. I know you are. Huh? Listen, Noah, I feel just the same. Without you, I think, my wishes would never have come true. I see. I guess so. Hmm. So I'll say it too. Thank you, Noah. Truly. We weren't half bad as a team, were we? Yeah, uh, passable, for sure. Just passable? I'm sure you meant unsurpassable, right? <laughs> I think I'll let you decide the passing grade, Lancy. Ah, come on, weirdo. Guess we won't be working out together anymore. Yeah. I'm not keeping tabs, but don't you slack off. I am not gonna slack off. I'll train every day, thinking of you. Yeah. Same here. Here. What's this? A herbal tea recipe. If you have to dry your own leaves, you should manage. Isn't this kind of pointless? Pointless? I mean, if the worlds are going to drift apart again, this paper won't last. <laughs> hmm? I considered that, of course. The paper and the ink, it all comes from your world. And the leaves with the tea? Even those and all? What do you think? <laughs> Check you out. Who am I if not scrupulous? Who? Well, you're my best bud. Fourth best, to be exact. Only fourth? Huh. Wait a minute. There's Noah and Lance. And did she count Joran? Oh, why am I only listing guys? Just chill out, Tyon. Um, uh. What's up? Is there a problem? Well, uh, at least put me second or even third. Fourth seems a little harsh. <laughs> I think about it. Riku! Manana! As time goes by, it is time. And we all change. And not just us, the world keeps changing. Guess this is goodbye. Yeah. Little did I know that Still. Even if we're worlds apart, I swear I won't. I won't let go. Not ever. I'll always be with you. Our feelings forever interlinked. Wherever we are. Yeah. Wherever we are. Our worlds in their current states are still young. If in passing, they do themselves harm. I suppose even then they cannot but carry on. Still, I have faith. Even if now we become separated for a time, one day we'll surely get to walk hand in hand again. Everyone, thank you.
of our world. Memories melt in the morning light and then a new day begins. Roads stretch out before us. So many paths. Which do you choose? That's up to you. Sometimes you might run astray. You'll stop. Maybe cry in frustration. But you know, that's all right. For the roads, they go on without end. So look up, face forward, toward your chosen horizon. And just walk on.
Noah! What are you doing, man? They'll start the fireworks without us. Get a move on already, or all the good spots will be taken. Exactly, so come on, move it! Sorry, I zoned out for a sec. I'm coming! I no longer see your silhouette. It's too far gone into the haze. But hey, it's all right. I won't forget you. Not until we can meet again. I swear it. <laughs>